Well, time is to roll, and this is going to be a quick check-in. We're going to see what's coming in for the collective. What you need to know right now for your greatest and highest good. You know why that box is sitting over there? Maybe you're supposed to, to clarify. Okay, I'm trying to keep the videos up under 10 minutes. Oh, come on. So we're going to check in and see where your person is feeling, what's going on with you guys right now. What you need to know about your relationship. Where is it going? It's for the collective spirit. What's going on with your relationship? Give me the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And I do need to jump. Okay, what does my collective need to know about the relationship and what's coming in for them? Okay, so the first card out says you are very close to achieving your goals. So whatever it is that you want in this relationship, you're very close to getting that. So if you're trying to get a commitment, you're trying to get something, um, like I said, I would say committed. Something committed or you want the marriage, That's you, you, you're there. You're almost there. Okay, guys, you're, you're there. Because a, a new start is, is coming in for you guys in this relationship here. So for those of you who are wanting a new relationship to come in, your singleness is coming to a close and you're finna start a new relationship. For those of you who are already in a relationship, um, maybe you just started dating or something, you want to you want to be committed, you're finna get committed. For those who are committed and want to go to the next level, engagement, that's, you know, that's where you're going. You're going to the next level in this relationship. What else is going on here? Yeah, the end of a tough cycle is approaching here, okay? So whatever tough cycles you had in love, whatever heartaches, whatever bad times, whatever issues you've had in love, that shit is coming to an end. you got a brand new start coming in this love here, okay, guys? Whether it's one you're already in or one that's coming in for you. Spirit says you need to work through your fears right now. Do not allow the past to come in and influence your future. Do not allow what people did to you, how they hurt you, how they mistreated you to um come in and fuck with you because you have a win-win outcome in your forecast, babies, okay? And at the bottom of the deck, luck is on your side. In this relationship. Okay. Spirit says now is the time for healing. So heal whatever um, you may be still holding on to from the past. Whether it's with this person or somebody else. And look at the bigger picture. Because you got a new brand new brand new love life coming in here for you. Like I said. Whether you were with somebody and you guys were just having a tough cycle. And you, you're moving forward. Or whether or not you've got somebody brand new. Things are changing. Spirit says, do not let your past hold you back. I told you. It's time to release whatever happened in the past and move forward. Whether it's with the same person or a new person. Work through whatever your fears are. Do not allow your fears to prevent you from having this new beginning here. Yes. Yeah, Spirit says, take time out to breathe. Just take a couple deep breaths so you can get through the fear. Okay? You can't have courage without fear. You need the fear so you can have courage. You got to walk through the fear. Spirit says you and your loved ones are safe. There's a win-win outcome here for you guys. So there's no need to worry. And the last card out for you is nothing will come of this situation if you don't heal. If you do not heal, nothing will come of this situation. Anything else, Spirit? Anything else I do need? Oh, that is way too many. They had a lot to say. What they said. Show the world the real you. Bring love into the situation. Hold your vision. You are good enough. Your dreams need a practical plan. Prosperity lies ahead. And the answers you need are coming. Just so y'all can know what they said. It was just too many at one time. Okay. Yeah. Expect a powerful change, guys. Brand new start. Look at the bigger picture here. The next one came out for you is a romantic cycle begins. A new romantic cycle begins. So do not allow your past to hold you back. Whatever tough cycles you had in love, that shit is coming to an end, babies. Heal. Do not allow fear to keep you. Take a deep breath and move forward. Thank you. Yeah. Conclusions are within reach. Like I said, whatever that in old in oh come on. It's Mercury retrograde. Whatever this tough cycle was, it is coming to an end. Okay, guys. Conclusions are within reach. You have a brand new beginning, brand new start, and a brand new romantic cycle beginning. Expect powerful change. Spirit says you need to meditate right now and contemplate on what your next moves are. Because there's a win-win outcome in your forecast here. 
Spirit says communication is the key. So the signs I have out here is Gemini, um, Capricorn, Scorpio, Libra, Sagittarius, Cancer, Pisces, Libra. That's what's showing here on the board. Let's see. We'll pull astrology jacks if we can get any other messages about your person. How they're feeling about you in this situation. What's coming in for you in your love life? What you need to know? Anything else, spirit? In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And I do need it to jump. Can you tell me about my co thank you, collective in their love life? So the first thing, destiny. This is your destiny, babies. This is your destiny. You're on the path to your destiny. What else does my collective need to know? Look, and you're being guided by spirit. And you just need to heal, babies. Heal and trust the spirit got you. You are, you are, you are on your path. Anything else my collective needs to know right now? Thank you. You've made a lot of sacrifices, guys, in the past. And because of this, you are being rewarded. Okay? The tough cycle is coming to an end. You're finna get everything you want. I have. Destiny is providing you. The universe is providing you with what you need here. The blessings. I can't make it up. Okay? You're finna get these blessings, babies. You just need to heal. Okay? And, and once you heal, you'll see everything. Everything will start to become clear once you do the healing. Clarify so sacrifice, spirit. Yeah. You gotta make the change. So what I have here is Taurus, Sagittarius as well. I got Scorpio, this person who wants to transform the situation. You need to transform the situation here. Okay, guys, I'm going to pull a couple of romance angels and then I'll close this, this reading out. Okay, spirit. Any final messages for my collective and their person? What's going on in this relationship here? There's some big changes coming. This person is bringing, yeah, this new romantic cycle is part of your destiny. Okay, what does my collective need to know in the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit about this relationship that they're... New outcome, this new relationship that they're going to do, this new romantic cycle. What does my collective need to know? Huh. It's going to be full of passion, y'all. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy when this person comes in. What else does my collective need to know about this new person coming in or this person returning? Okay, so somebody needs to release their ex. You need to let go of the past. The time has come to clear your energy, guys, okay? You have to let go of the past. That's what you need to heal. But this 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 new romantic uh, relationship is going to have a lot of attraction here. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully, guys. Anything else my collective needs to know before we close out this reading? Very soon, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now, babies. Anything else? New love is here. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. They haven't showed up. They're finna show up. So you need to release this ex. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. You got to let go of what this ex did to you. Because you deserve love. And you are lovable. And you have this new love coming in for you. It's going to be full, with a, uh, full of attraction. Full of passion. One more spirit. For my collective before we close it out. What else do they need to know? Anything else? Thank you. Huh. This could end up involving a marriage, guys. This could be the one, okay? This situation involves marriage. So very soon, clearly decide what it is that you want. Huh, at the bottom of the deck, this was worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. You had to go through all these things, these cycles, to close out these cycles to have this brand new beginning, guys. But you have a new romantic beginning. A new start is coming. Conclusions to things that no longer serve you are being released. And Spirit says, expect this powerful change. This is um, religious factors. Your love life is influenced by religious upbringing and spiritual past. Whenever I get this card, this card to me means divine timing. Okay? So everything is working out for you in divine timing at this time. 
Spirit says, stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance, babies, okay? All right. I feel like it's two more. I keep telling me it's two more. So I'm going to pull two more, and then I'm going to close this reading out. That's one. Give me one more. What's the second one? Oh, they gave me three. Okay, so babies, you need to let go of control issues, okay? Go with the flow with this relationship. Do not allow what happened in your past. you got to release this ex so you can release the control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally, babies, okay? The next one, Spirit says, flirt and extend your lighthearted energy to others. And the last one that came out for you is worth waiting for. Like I said, divine timing is at work in your love life. This new relationship, this new love was worth waiting for. You had to go through what you had to go through to get to this point, okay? Spirit says, keep an open mind because your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. Okay, so I'm going to leave this here. If it resonated with you, you'd like to know more about your story, all my information is down below in the description box, guys. Leave me a comment. Hit the like button. Hit the subscription button. Also, um, check out my other channel if you're interested, guys. All that information is down below as well. Um, you can also check out my products. All that information is down below as well. So until next time, guys, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Bye, TT babies. Mwah!